Disclaimer. I sound funny because I got my wisdom teeth taken out. Enjoy the video. All right, what's up? It's your favorite Mexican Renko here. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are taking it easy on this day we're having, bro. Today, we're going to be looking at a family channel on YouTube, which, uh, which means... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, if you guys aren't aware of what happens after a youtuber makes a video on these family channels Usually the actual fans of the family channels will swarm the commentators video That's talking about the family channel and spam it with dislikes And it's usually because these commentators are critiquing these family channels for you know Faking content stuff like that and do keep in mind that the average audience age range I'd say for these family channels is like 7 to 12 years old I really couldn't imagine a 25 year old even a 18 year old just being like oh god I love the royalty family their content is so interesting it's so fun to watch too and that's not even a diss on their content it's mostly due to the fact that like these family channels typically make content for these young audiences but yeah enough about that today we're going to be looking at the royalty family they recently came out with a video uh well, not even recently. It was like around a month ago. So I guess it is somewhat recent. Whatever. The title reads, Somebody broke into our new home! Asterisk, asterisk, live camera, asterisk, asterisk. The royalty family. <laughs> Anyways, when I first saw this video, I was like, damn, really? Somebody really tried to break into their home? That shit is messed up. I've been robbed out of like a pencil a few times in high school, but I, I really couldn't imagine somebody actually coming into your house and like taking your stuff, dude. That must have been scary. Not even scary, bro. Like uh, terrifying. But I decided to take a look at the video and something seemed sort of off. So, uh, you know, I wanted to make a video uh, talking about it. Anyways, before this video starts, if we can shoot for 300 likes, dude, that, that would be pretty neat. If you do like this video, I'll give you a free blackberry phone from the prehistoric age or some shit so yeah you definitely want that huh anyways without further ado grab your popcorn dude grab your wholesomeness and let's let's watch this video dude hey, yo, intro what's going on guys it's your boy key it's really hey hey yeah, I don't know why I paused just for that. I thought it would be funny, but it's obviously not. Loki kind of uh sounds like that one Lego guy in the commercials. You know what I'm talking about? Start the new rescue helicopter. <laughs> Is anyone here? Hey! Yeah, I see someone. I see someone in there. Hey! What are you doing here? Yo, who was it? Yo, hold on, hold on. Go to the other side. Yo, yo what? <laughs> Bro, I was actually drawn in by that clip, and then they just hit us with their intro. That shit was so random. I mean, I guess that's th the point. Royalty family wants that watch time, so they'll keep you interested in their video by putting the highlights first or something. I don't really know how vlog YouTubers work. I can't really say much because I'm not one. But honestly, dude, the royalty family just hit us with that reverse card. Stay royalty. What the hell is going on, dude? This kid looks like he's fighting the Ender Dragon or some shit, dude. I'm <laughs> looking mad focused. My man's Ferran on the sticks, bro. I mean, his facial expressions are kind of scaring me. God, I cannot speak, bro. His facial expressions are kind of scaring me. They don't really look real. I'm sort of scared, but I, I mean, I'm not at the same time because, you know, he's nine years old. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to question how many energy drinks this kid has slammed uh, or how many Coke lines he sniffed. I'm dead. Okay, not even gonna lie, that Jeep is pretty sexy. I'm almost positive that's a Jeep, because car people are gonna be like, Um, actually, no, it's a model that looks like a Jeep. Get it right. You know, I don't care. Regardless, looks pretty sick, and I would definitely be whipping that and doing donuts. Quit playing with me. You are they named their dog Gucci? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I guess that goes to show how much the family cares about materialistic things. Bro, look at the dog, man. He's actually cute, too. Or she. I don't, I don't know. You could have named your dog something wholesome, like Douglas or Paul. He looks like a Paul. I don't really care if it's a girl or not. You should have named your dog Paul. Look how cute he looks, bro. Not that Gucci is a bad name or anything, but it, it just... Eh, Gucci, dude? I, I think Paul's more fitting. Okay, I'm just gonna save you some time and skip the intro because you get the point, you know, it's it's the royalty family This is their video that you're watching. So yeah What's up royalty fam? Um, it's currently 11 p.m. And we just got news that Someone broke into our new house as you guys know, we just bought a new house the new royalty palace. We haven't moved in yet um, Okay, so I, I was actually so distracted by what he was saying that I actually didn't get to catch a glance at his eyes Bro, he is staring at me. I'll just be staring bro I don't know if there's some like barbecue ribs behind the camera and he's just fiending or something But it's really making me mad uncomfy right now. Honestly, uh, why are you staring at me? What do you want? Uh, there's no meme to take off your clothes. But I got access to the cameras 
and I saw someone jumping in, hopping the fence, and it's currently 11 o'clock. There's no one supposed to be there. still talking here. Nothing. I'm just talking to the royalty family, telling them what's going on. This is not a good time to tell the royalty family. So guys, check this out. Yeah, I mean, I, I am going to have to agree with his wife. What was her name again? Andrea. Okay, it's Andrea. I agree with Andrea. I don't think vlogging while somebody's trying to break into your house is the best idea. You know, not saying you shouldn't, but... <laughs> I feel like maybe just putting the camera down and focusing on the situation, you know? Something smart. Bro, some of these vloggers, man, I, I don't know what goes on in their brain. They're just a different breed of human, dude. I swear to God. Andrea wants me to call the cops, and I feel like we shouldn't call the cops. It's so sobering. In these cases, everyone called the cops. Literally took the words out of my mouth. You should uh, definitely call the cops. I would probably call the cops if I heard the slightest bit of movement in my house, bro. I'm going to keep it a stack with you. Uh, being alone sometimes is cool, but when you're home alone, it's a different story. I'll be making sure every single door is locked, windows closed, nobody's breaking into this house, dude. I'm almost positive that they're just acting, and he's just saying this because, you know, he wants to make a whole video on this, and it's pretty, it would be pretty boring if the cops just showed up and arrested the dude, and then, boom, the vid's done. Whatever, I'm talking too much, dude. Let's continue. Why are you it's, so stubborn? I don't want to... It's, it's, it's a crazy world that we live in right now. I don't want to get any, a homeless person in trouble. I don't want to get a construction worker in trouble. People are going through hard times. No, Let me just go check it out. Ah, yeah. You know, uh, if you're going through a hard time, maybe you got kicked out. My first option would definitely be to climb into somebody's backyard and pray that they come inside and hand feed me everything in their pantry. It's not like there's, you know, hundreds of other places available. Homeless shelters, uh, the bus stop. I sort of hate how he kind of uses that as an excuse for somebody to break into his house. Like, bro, you pay the rent for this place. You, <laughs> you don't want to at least, you know, make sure nobody gets in. Just makes no sense, dude. I understand, but we need to... First, think about our house. I know, <laughs> but we have nothing important in our house. Like it's it's under construction. It's like the, the, uh, what do you mean? There the most important. Thing, I know, I know. But if someone seen. breaks in just to sleep there, it's not the end of the world. You know? All right, name one case where some guy just breaks into someone's backyard and is just like you know. <laughs> Like, that doesn't really happen. <laughs> if they're breaking into your house, they're most definitely gonna want something. They're not just gonna be looking for a nap. God damn it, dude. Why Why am I even explaining this? Now I just look stupid. What if it's just to sleep there and they're gonna steal something? You don't know. I mean, it... it, it, it <sighs> You make Relax. so stressed out. Relax. Like just go back to sleep. I'll take care of it. I'll what should we do? Call the cops. That's it. Maybe stop filming, too. You know, uh, just a tip. Wouldn't hurt, you know? Oh, you know, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to the house. I'm gonna go to the house. I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna go, if Will's still awake, I'm gonna get Will. He's gonna come with me. Everything's gonna be fine. Oh, just trust me. Uh, I'm honestly not cool with calling cops on, on homeless people or whatever. I don't know. How does he know if the person is homeless or not? Like, right now, this is a person that's breaking into your house. Nothing more, nothing less. He's kind of promoting the idea of not calling the cops when somebody breaks into your house. Like, dude, people go to jail for that. Breaking into somebody's house is a crime. Uh, if you didn't know, you should definitely call the cops if it uh, happens. Again, don't really know why. I need to explain this. I'm gonna go find out what it is, what's going on. For those of you that are wondering what I saw, this is basically what I saw on the camera. I know what you guys are thinking, don't go, but I'm gonna go and find out what's going on. Bro, he is still staring at the camera, stop it. Should I call the cops or should I go find out what's going on myself? I'll take Will with me, we'll be fine, we'll be safe. You know what guys? I'm gonna make this quick. I'm gonna go wake up Will. Okay, don't listen to me. Don't listen to me. Mi amor. That's fine. That's fine. It's not about it's not about listening to you. Uh bro? Bro, please tell me they are not about to start arguing. If there's one thing I dislike, it's listening to relationship arguments. Usually it'll be about the most stupid stuff too. Like, uh, baby, why were you FaceTiming Madison before me? Like, bro, chill out. That is my aunt. I don't even know, dude. I, yeah. I just wanna go do what's right. right. I don't wanna call the cops. Alright, go call the cops. Like right now we just got a new house and I don't wanna send cops. To the new house. I want you to get in trouble, that's all. Why would I get in trouble? Uh, I don't know. Maybe because, you know, somebody's breaking into your house and you want to directly confront them. I mean, in a sense, I can understand where he's coming from, but if it's somebody you don't know, you have no idea if he's strapped up with like a 12 gauge shotgun or something like that. I mean, maybe calling the cops would be a good choice. I almost ran out of breath there. God damn. Nonetheless, I'm getting tired of them staying inside the house. So, you know, I, I came here to see this dude tackle the man breaking in. So let's just skip to that part or the part where they explore outside, I guess. Let, let's go there. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. Just be careful, be careful, be careful. Before you go, put the light on. Put the light on. Okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was the gate that someone came through. Oh, look, it's open. <laughs>
What is that? The subtitles on the bottom are dumb enough, but they had to add emoticon gifs or emoji, whatever. I know a lot of people don't really care about this, but I do. Uh, the emoji on the right isn't centered or symmetrical with the one on the left, and it's really pissing me off, dude. Like, if you're gonna add an emoji in the video editing, at least put them in the right position. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. Oh, it's still open. You see? It's still open. Oh, okay. They gotta, they gotta still be here. All right, here's the game plan. And I want you to listen carefully, okay? Right. The most important thing is that we stick by each other the whole time. Yeah. We never leave each other in there, okay? okay? Bro, shut up. This is your house. Uh, This is the place where you go to sleep. Shit, I mean, if it really comes down to it, you can legally shoot somebody that breaks into your house. 35 states are stand your ground states, man. It's, it's your property. He's acting like this is some sort of escape room, dude. Like, this is your property and somebody's trespassing. I know this is fake, but they aren't really faking it too well, obviously. If you hear anything, or if we see anything, we gotta let each other know we gotta leave right away and we go back to the car, okay? Do you think it's better if we call the police? The thing is, I don't wanna call the police because I feel like it might be a construction worker that's trying to come in and, and sleep over here. Which is, drum roll please, trespassing. I feel like there's a bunch of people watching that are thinking to themselves, hey, if somebody breaks into my house, I'll, I'll probably just let them stay in there because you know, they might be homeless, who knows? And right before they know it, uh, the intruder walks into the room and one taps them in the head and takes her stuff. See what I'm saying? Not calling the cops during an emergency is not really something you should be promoting. Anyways, he finds the person quote unquote breaking into his house, obviously an actor or a friend, but here's a little clip. Hey, who is it? Hey! He's running, he's running, he fell, he fell. Come back, come back, hey! What are you doing here? Hey, come back! <laughs> Honestly, that clip is probably the most hysterical part of the video because he sounds like a GTA 5 NPC whenever he says something. Hey, come back! Hey, stop! Hey, uh, stop! But yeah, towards the end of the video, you always gotta show your audience that you're a, you're a person that gives back to the community. So he pulls out his racks and gives, you know, the homeless man some money, even though, you know, he, he broke into his house. Okay, yeah. You guys already know why this is stupid. So this guy's telling me that he lost his job and he's got nowhere to stay. I can't have him be here. But at the same time, I don't want him to stay on the streets. So whatever, man. It is what it is. I can't be selfish. It's the right thing to- What? Honestly, no. I think the right thing to do is call the cops on somebody who's literally trespassing on your property. Like, what? Whatever. I've had enough of this video, dude. That's enough internet for today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. Even though there'll probably be more dislikes than likes, I'm, I'm not really worried too much. If you guys want to see more content like this in the future, make sure to subscribe. And please do not go out of your way to send hate to the royalty family. I recognize that their content is made for kids and kids only. It's fairly obvious. So yeah, everything that I said was for the purpose of satirical comedy. Nothing should be taken to heart. Somehow I made it through this video with a bunch of stitches in my gums. So yeah, drop a like for that. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Okay, thanks for watching. Penis, penis. Now subscribe or die. I need your ad revenue to survive. No, seriously, please. I need money. I'm about please to go home. Hey, it's your boy Keith. Subscribe to Pawn Show yes. or else you're gonna yes. get the smoke. Just saying.